In this video, I'm going to show you in Articulate Storyline how to stop slides from automatically advancing without the user doing anything, which can be quite annoying actually. Often happens if you import a PowerPoint. Let me show you the problem. So if I was to preview this entire project, project started, I'm not doing anything, ignore that it looks terrible. I'm not doing it, there you go, it's just move to the next slide. And after about three or four seconds, I think it's four seconds, move to the next slide. I'm not doing anything. Now, I don't want this to happen. So how do I stop it? Well, it's actually really easy to stop it. it needs to be in story view. So if you're in this view normally, which is you know, the, the way you edit things, just go to story view, which is top left. Single click on any slide, though it makes sense to click on the first one. Bottom right, you have slide advances and you have automatically. Now notice in the triggers, we have a trigger that says jump to slide next slide when the timeline ends on this slide. So slide advances automatically. If I click on that, I change that to by user, you'll notice that this trigger is going to disappear. There we go, it's disappeared. Which means that the only way to advance to the next slide is by clicking on the next button or swiping or whatever rule you put in place. The problem is though, that slide advances is still here for all of these other slides, but you can quickly solve it. Single click on the first slide, on your keyboard, Control and A, which will select all. Slide advances, click on that, change that to by user, and then problem solved. Go to any slide, you'll see that it must slide advance by user. Of course, you can manually change these if you wish to do so. Don't forget to save your project, but that's your problem solved. Hopefully you found this video useful. If so, like the video, subscribe to my channel for more top tech tips.